it's good it's good to negotiate because you then understand what your position is mm -hmm. yeah it's good um and <laughs> my 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 advice i don't know if this is good advice to you because i don't know the situation well enough but if you want to um, if you want two hours ask for three mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. you understand what i'm saying right yeah yeah no that that's me i don't know enough about the situation but that's in general how to approach that type of problem yeah um if you really want two hours extra ask for three Mm -hmm. uh, possible scenarios um, you don't get three whatever uh, you get three with conditions whatever you don't get you don't get three well then that puts you in a more interesting position to ask for two because you appear mm -hmm. to be you appear to be compromising when you're not <laughs> <laughs> Is that mm -hmm. is that manipulative? Look, don't don't don't. I, I wouldn't live relationships like that. But if part of this process is financial, I consider it acceptable mm -hmm. to ne to negotiate in that way, because money is completely illogical anyway. So if you look at how money works, it's just mad. So. Uh, so that I think gives certain opportunities to uh, to be flexible in terms in terms of negotiation. Um, so give yourself some leverage to give give yourself room to move. Mm -hmm. Because if they reject three hours, then you can go back to them and say, look. Could you do two and a half? Mm -hmm. <laughs> and if you reject two and a half, you can go back to them and say, could you do two? And remember that the same question asked at a different time in a different place can get a different answer. So giving people time mm -hmm. to consider things again and again and again can lead to a better opportunity for you to get what you want in that kind mm -hmm. of situation. So um, have a more long-term strategy rather than just saying, I want just this here. Let people, let people dwell on the idea. Don't make decisions for them. Let people, let people, contemplate the information if they if they think about it at all you know it's a mistake to think that other people are thinking especially about us right remember that other people are thinking about their shit right and, yeah. you're, tr and you're trying to solve your shit right <laughs> so yeah. so that that that's always the case of you know how can you help how can you help them as well how can you bring value to them in a way where they're more comfortable allowing you the space that you need, um, which is something you can say to them. You say to them, look, I, I realize that this is going to benefit me. It might make a problem for you, but I want to bring more value to you. So tell me how I can bring more value to you. I'm asking you to tell me how I can help you more to get the things that I need for us all to go forward. Because here's, 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 here's the, the key point. If nothing changes, then nothing gets better. Mm -hmm. And over time, over time, yeah, over time, that's not a good thing. That might be okay today and this week and next week, but over time, it's not a good thing. We all know that. We all know that. So you can you know, present to them, look, I'm trying to change things to make things better. So that we have more keyword, we have more sustainability when we have more of when we're happier about what it is that we do. And mm -hmm. happiness is important, right? Yeah. 
it, it, it's important. So, you know, le leverage as much as you can to, to, to your advantage in that kind, in that kind of situation. Um, and as it's, it's different, I think it's good to give people time to think about things because you know, people, thoughtful people will consult other people about what they think is the right thing as well. Yeah. Mm -hmm. no, they'll ask. They'll, they'll ask other people. You know, somebody's asked for this. You know, should I give them this or should I give them that? Was that was that the right thing that I did? You know, because people will make the wrong decision sometimes, and maybe people will change their mind as well. So, um, one thing's for sure: if you don't put out the question, you don't get a response, right? That's a mm -hmm. One of the worst things in life is having questions unanswered because you never asked them. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> yep. Yep. That's right. right. Mm. It, it doesn't mean that a person should be impolite or. Uh, offensive or, or aggressive in the way that they do things it, it just there's there's just a certain need to express what it is that that you need mm -hmm. otherwise mm -hmm. otherwise you're living for other people and this concept of needs was and the the first topic that uh, that I wanted to discuss because we don't want to live unfulfilled lives and we are unfulfilled if we're not able to express our needs if we're not able to communicate to other people what what we need what happens in the long term is we tend to blame other people for not automatically knowing what it is that we need You were you were like this when I needed that, and the other person's like, "Well, I didn't know because you didn't tell me. I didn't tell you because you didn't ask." And it's just like a fucking circle, right? <laughs> yeah, concrete circle. Can't break it. Uh, at that point, you 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 can't because you know you the the argument just solidifies the fact that you're not going anywhere because you're having the argument because you didn't solve the problem at the beginning. Which is, you know, your your friend deciding whether or not they want to have the baby is not the problem. Mm -hmm. The problem is how the fuck did they get into that stupid situation of having to ask that stupid question in the first place? Mm -hmm. No offense, but, uh, but the, the, the problem is very often not the problem. Mm -hmm. Right. The problem is very often not the problem. The problem is how the fuck did we get into this situation of having to deal with this problem, right? So it's it's it, it, it's the process that that led us there, and uh, uh, it's uh, uh, <laughs> it's very interesting. It's very interesting. There's um. Uh, the benefit of hindsight, yeah. You know, looking, looking back, it's looking back is easy to uh, understand what is right and wrong. Looking forward, it's much more complicated. Um, but uh, there are general rules about what is about what is about what is right. Uh, it is necessary to preserve life; otherwise, we don't have anything, right?